Hey guys, Basil here with BTech. This video is all about the Samsung Galaxy Notes S Pen. The Note 7 announced today here in the UK and in its concurrent event in New York skips the Note 6 so that you can get in line with the S7 numerical system. I'm not fussed about that. What I am fussed about is this phone's coming to Europe, this phone looks sweet, and this phone has an S Pen. 4096 levels of pressure sensitivity. 4096. That is the most precious sensitive screen I've ever seen in my life. World first for smartphones, if I'm correct, and that is awesome. The S Pen slots nicely into the bottom right hand side of the Note's curved body. It's got a curved Super AMOLED display, Quad HD resolution. Looks the business. Right, you've got Samsung Note. That's a new version of S Note. Samsung Note allows for doodling. There are loads of pen options, etc. You can see my speed sketch that I did within Samsung Note. You've also got a whole load of other things things that you can do. For starters, you can draw on the always on display. Um, and this means when your phone's in standby, you can actually take a note, to save your note, and then you can access it when you come to switch your phone on again. You can also magnify various elements of the home screen, highlight a word and have it translated out. You can select a various part of the home screen and you can have that transcribed. So even if you grab the portion of the home screen as an image, you can actually transcribe the words, which is very, very useful and very cool. What's even better is that you can highlight a portion of your home screen and turn it into a GIF. Yes, you can share it, not necessarily through WhatsApp, but through Twitter and through Facebook, and then uh, make GIFs from YouTube videos, make GIFs from personal videos really, really quickly, which is something that Android has had to have third-party apps to do in the past, and never ever has it worked as seamlessly as I've seen it work on the Note 7, which is sweet. There are a few other elements to the Note 7's S Pen, but they're not really gonna be as amazing as the ones I've just discussed, aside from the fact that you can use it underwater, and that means if you live here in Old Blighty, you can use it in the rain as well. So that's the S Pen and the Note 7 and the 4096 levels of pressure sensitivity under the Super AMOLED display. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. Like this video, click like, like the channel, subscribe, helps us out like crazy, and you stay on top of everything we do. Thanks for watching.